Hello friends and welcome to the video tutorial of Form Builder app by UVDisk. Now in this video tutorial, we will show you how you can create custom form using a Form Builder app for the Salesforce website. So we will create a site in the Salesforce backend and then we will show you how you can implement your custom form in that particular site. So first, this is my UVDisk panel. So in my previous video, I have already explained you how you can create custom form. So I'll show you the path. You have to go to the app and then form builder. So from here, you can create a new form by entering the name and selecting the uh, your type of fields you need in your form. And for your custom field, if you need, you can go to your ticket custom field and you can create the same. You can follow my previous videos in which I have explained the same. Now we will come back to a contact form. Then from here, you can preview the form which will be displayed to the user when you will implement this form in your website. And this is get embed code. So you can get the code in two type, iframe version and JS version. So now let's move you to Salesforce. So this is my Salesforce panel. So we'll go to setup. And now under the setup, we'll go to your develop. And now under your develop, you can see your sites. So click on this link. And then you can see what is a site they have explained you and then from here you can this is my already created site and from here you can create a new site so you have to enter your site label site name site description site contact name this is your default web address now this is all for the demo purpose and this is active site home page so from here you can select which part you want to display on the home page of your site when any user visits your site so you can select answer home bandwidth exceeded change password customer key prefix forget password site login site register so i have selected site register and then you have to save from here now i have already created this site so i will edit the site and then from here i have selected the site register and then you have to save and now you can see your site detail so active site homepage is site register so from here you can preview it and you can see how your homepage will look so this is the homepage so now we will go to our visual force pages so this is my visual force pages so i will click on edit and now you can see your label your name your description and this is your visual marker now go back to your form builder and copy your iframe version and now again here you have to enter this code first before and after your iframe version code and then you have to save now after saving you will be redirected back to this page now again this is your register page like home page I will refresh this page and now you can see your custom form which we have created by the help of UV disk so I will enter my name over here I can select my query type I can enter my subject And I can enter my 
message and then I will click on submit and now you can see you have successfully created a ticket with ID number 16 so I'll go back to my UV desk and I will go to my ticket then you can see your ID number 16 name is John and this is your subject and this is your message so from here your support staff can reply back to the query asked by this particular customer and this particular customer can log in into the mail which they have entered over here and then they will get a link from the UV desk to reset the password and the link for the customer to log in and then they can see the reply by the support staff for this particular ticket and then they can communicate with the ticket system only so this is all about this particular form builder app if you have any doubt regarding this form builder app you can raise a support ticket at support at webcool.com thank you very much for watching this video tutorial have a nice day